Hello and welcome to another video. So this is Spain Here We Come Mark 2. For those of you who watched the previous video you'll know that it picked up the new motorhome. Fortunately there were a couple of issues. Most of them were minor and I know a few of you have been asking what the issues were. Um, the main one that stopped us using it was that the shower didn't work properly so the plan was to wild camp down into Spain but obviously we couldn't do that without a shower. So we literally took the motor back to the dealer and put everything into a two seater convertible sports car, don't ask me how. Um, somehow we managed it and set off down to uh, Folkestone and got the tunnel and headed down to Spain. Um, we've decided to keep the video with a bit of a motorhome theme going so we found a few airs and we'll do a review on where we stayed because we still stayed on a campsite just to keep that motorhome theme in our videos so hopefully you enjoy the video um, we'll get on the train and we will see you on the other side in France Welcome to France. Not the sunny France that we were expecting, but hey ho. So, as we've set off a little bit earlier and we're not in the motor, we've decided that the best weather in France is down the west coast. So, we're just going to get on the road, head down to sort of Le Mans, and then across to the coast and see where we end up. We made our way down to St Jean de Monts, I think that's how you pronounce it anyway, on the coast. Beautiful little town, um, definitely worth a visit if you're heading this way. It caters for motorhomes, there's a massive seafront, plenty of parking on the seafront. This is all height barriered, um, but there is an air at the end of the town which we'll show you. Um, so you can park up there, it's safe. Um, but yeah, lovely little town, found a lovely little hotel. There's also an air on the way in at the service U garage where you can stay overnight there's a service point you get your water and things like that See the air just on the right hand side there and see all the motor homes.
this is the air that we found in the town. It's only a five minute walk from the seafront. Um, it's barriered. You pay, I think it was something like 14 euros for 24 hours. It's accessed via the machine at the entry. It was really, really busy, um, which was a good sign. Obviously, we didn't go in because you have to pay to get through the barrier and things like that. We might look a bit weird in a car going in anyway. But as you can see, plenty of people there, nice and easy. Um, there is a Facebook page, so if you want some more information, if you head over to that Facebook page, you should be able to find what you need. So the next morning we got up and decided that we'd just drive down the coast road, head south, sort of see where we end up. Um, there's plenty of airs on the way down. We've taken some videos to keep that motorhome theme going and show you them. We've also put them on the Facebook page so you can see them. Um, but they were beautiful little airs, ideally placed. Um, so yeah, beautiful coastline, definitely worth an explore if you get the chance. We decided as we weren't booked onto the first campsite until Sunday and we couldn't check in until four o'clock. We had a bit of extra time. So thanks to the Rook family who did their video on Andorra, we decided that we'd go and see Andorra. Um, the, view, the scenery on the way in is absolutely stunning. As you go through the bottom of France into Andorra, it is beautiful. Um, it is accessible for motorhomes. If you're in a tag, it is probably going to be a little bit of hard work. There's quite a few switchbacks on some of the roads in, um, but it's doable. You head through a lot of the little ski villages, which are absolutely stunning, before you get to Andorra La Vella, which where we parked up, that's kind of the main place. Um, again, absolutely beautiful. Um, a little bit on the expensive side, I would say, um, but stunning. It's definitely worth a visit.
heading down into Spain, so we will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.